Hi Aquarius, this is your monthly love tarot cards reading by Emma for the month of March 2021. This time it is for those single and unattached Aquarius people. We're going to start with four cards. Seven of Cups. Five of Swords. <coughs> the Four. <coughs> Seven of Wands. Page of Cups. Your influencing energy. Let's draw another four. Representing you, your inner world. Four of Pentacles with a Seven of Cups. Five of Swords with Nine of Swords. The Fool with Ace of Cups and Seven of Wands with Queen of Wands, Eight of Wands, your influencing energy. Uh, single Aquarius. No, Eight of Wands, Page of Cups. This is offer that comes to you. That was, we are talking now influencing energy. That is something that happened in February, maybe in January. But for some reason, important for you this, this month, uh, this March. This is intense conversation, intense communications. Maybe if it's somebody who's younger, very young person, younger than you. But this is communicating, talking, you know, exchanging information, you know, uh, exchanging information or something. But by all means, communicating with this person. And this is kind of a very romantic one. You know, something that is very beginning. You... Um, no, not really. With eight of with eight of wands, yeah, you would love it. But now, let's see what what how it's gonna work. You know, eight of wands. Uh, you want to know everything before you commit. First week of March, seven of cups. I love in the in love readings because it's your fantasy, your imagination, your romantic self, thinking, loving it, uh, planning your future, seeing your options for your life, life, love, life for yourself. Many people, many possibilities for you. But you yourself, you are now very, um, how can I put it, very contracted within yourself. You're not going to say yes to this person. If this is offered that comes from February, yeah, you've got, you are dreaming about it. You would love it. You are very romantic. You would love to have a relationship. You see this option. You see this possibility. But this is more platonic. You yourself, you have to be safe. You must be safe and secure. You won't say yes until everything is known. Everything is certain to you. Something like that, Aquarius. You need your certainty. You need to know everything. And you all contracted within yourself. Even your mind is working over time. <laughs> you know, your imagination is really beautiful there. You won't do nothing. You won't go for it. You won't go for this person, for this relationship. Not right now. Until, not until you are certain about everything. That everything going to be right. That, that it is good option for you. No, second week. Nine of swords with the five of swords. No, this combination is so yucky. This is somebody trying to bring you down. Somebody is jealous with you. Somebody is mean towards you. These are mean words. It comes maybe from this young person. Maybe this person is, I don't know, losing patience with you. And, and that is, you know, uh, words that come from blaming you for something, point finger at you, trying to bring you down, jealous or envy you or simply gossiping around you. You know, you did open up a little bit in here with this eight of wands. Perhaps this person is, I don't know, gossiping or something. And, but definitely, you see what I'm saying? These are words which you don't like. Behind you, behind your back or something. But unpleasant energy. Could be that comes from this person because this person cannot wait any longer. You are sitting on the fence and you're keeping this person on the side, on a backyard for far too long. And this person is a bit bitter there. Your nightmare, you really do not like it. You fear, can't you fear this person? You fear this ugliness, this mean. You fear that you're going to be offended, you're going to be hurt. That kind of second week of March, quite un 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 um, unpleasant. But 
third week of March is really beautiful. Now, Ace of Cups with the Fool. Now we are talking something, something real. Okay, this is very beginning, not even beginning, but this is almost decision. This is kind of willingness because Ace of Cups is rather loving, loving energy, loving, happy energy. You are offering to this person and this person is, I don't know, happy no end. With the Fool, again, I mean, I'm going to relate to this page of Cups to young person, perhaps. Perhaps this person that you are interested in, person that is interested in, um, actually in you or art, I think everything comes from this person, offer comes from this person. Person is perhaps very, very young or much younger than you or it's a different race or it's, I don't know, um, same sex or, or, you know, could be anything that is unusual. Something like that comes with full, but you are accepting it. You see that that person can bring love, brings just love for you, and you are offering love to this person. You are accepting it and offering it back, and this person is happy no end. Something like that, but lovely, you know, whatever that is. You feel, you are seeing this opportunity for love with this person, and it doesn't matter if it's young or old or, or black or white or whatever religion or something, whatever. You don't care about it, as long as it's loving and happy. That's kind of nice. Now, Queen of Wands within you is also very nice. This is very happy energy, but very solid. It's a queen. It's caring, solid energy. You do care about this person. This person really wants relationship with you. Standing firmly, you know, that offer that you receive in February comes back again. Now, we have to be together. You see, we have to be together. There's good reason. There's arguments. Who cares what people are going to say? Because people were perhaps mean because of that something unusual, that age difference or something. You see what I'm saying? But this person is now telling you who cares if we love each other, standing firmly by that, you know, opinion. If we are good with each other, if we are happy with each other, who cares what arguments going to come? Who cares what other people going to say? very adamant your partner in here perhaps not partner yet but it will be you know this is kind of moving forward this will be a relationship if it's not by the end of the march it's definitely going to be in april because queen of wands is very brave person as well this is fire energy brave um unorthodox you will accept this person. Whatever the difference between you people is, it wouldn't matter for Queen of Wands, for this energy of Queen of Wands. As I said, this is rather, um, rather enthusiastic, jolly, happy person, and it's not scared. This, you know, this one, you won't scare so easy because it's kind of good and happy and very confident with itself that one. Um, and it's kind of on its own. That energy is kind of good for itself, could be a bit unusual itself, this queen, because it's very intuitive, does have premonition about things, about future. Very lovely energy. That's why I'm saying that perhaps, perhaps by the end of the March, you are not still in the relationship, but that is serious thing is happening in here. Something is really cooking. They uh, began in February with this offer and um, yeah, it's going well. It's going well. Second part of March is going well. And uh, perhaps um, some of you in April not going to watch my uh, singles readings. <laughs> Anyway, enjoy your queries.